And you must be cautious because making your life better means adopting a lot of responsibility and that takes more effort and care than living stupidly in pain and remaining arrogant, deceitful and resentful. What if it was the case that the world revealed whatever goodness it contains in precise proportion to the, your desire for the best? Notice your desire, what you aim at. What if the world revealed itself? Because sometimes it just does. That's the power of aiming at something true. But just because you want something, you aim at something, doesn't mean the world will actually reveal itself. It's not the secret. This doesn't uh, the secret the book I'm referring to. Um, doesn't mean you can't. Doesn't mean that you can have what you merely want by wishing for it. Or that everything is interpretation, or that there's no reality. The world is still there with structures and limits. As you move along it, it cooperates or objects to your action or inaction. Just added that in. Not just by sitting here, and closing, you know, getting our fingers together and just wishing and hoping. Nope. If, you hear, if you're still watching this thinking that's going to happen, bye-bye. Leave. It's not what we're here for. It's not what's happening. It's not theology. It's not mysticism. It's empirical knowledge. There's no ma nothing magical here. If we start aiming at something, at something different, something like I want my life to be better, more productive, more fulfilling, our minds will start presenting us with new information derived from the previously hidden world to aid us in that pursuit. Then we can put that information to use and move and act and observe and improve. Notice, act, observe, improve. Act is the key word I'm emphasizing right here. You must act. If you do not act, you do not move. Well, you do not move forward, rather me. If you inact, stay stagnant, you move backward. And discipline is a key core component to this. And it must be it's gonna be cultivated through action and through just tireless daily work. And you cannot aim yourself at anything if you are completely undisciplined and untutored. You will not know what to target and you won't fly straight, even if you somehow get your aim right. And then you will conclude there is nothing to aim for, and then you'll be lost.